Most countries are now moving away from fossil fuels, and that's why a nuclear innovation company founded by Bill Gates is setting up a power plant at a town in America's Wyoming state. Here's how natrium technology could be the future of advanced clean energy. Welcome to Kimara, a sleepy town in the American state of Wyoming. It is here that Bill Gates is launching an ambitious project to counter climate change. Enter nuclear energy technology, Gates's company TerraPower will set up a non-traditional sodium-cooled reactor. One that will bring workers from a local coal-fired plant scheduled to close down soon. Many see the project as a much-needed economic boost. I don't know if Kimmer would have survived if we lost the power plant and the coal mine both. It may have just turned into a ghost town. With what's happening here with the nature and power plant, um, that's, that's the survival of our community. For many U.S. states transitioning away from coal, oil and natural gas, nuclear power is emerging as an answer to fill the gap only to reduce greenhouse gas emissions and stave off the worst effects of a warming planet. So we fully expect you know, a massive expansion of wind and solar and we're for that. But the complement that wind and solar, if, if we're going to shut off the fossil sources over time, we really need a source like nuclear that's emission free and that's running 24 seven. The plant Kamara reactor uses natrium technology. This is a sodium-cooled, fast reactor paired with an energy storage system. It is also less expensive than conventional water-cooled nuclear plants. So, um, just like in a coal plant where you'd have combustion, instead we have fission creating the heat. And so we have to remove the heat from the fuel. And the way we remove the heat from the fuel is with liquid sodium. Plant's peak capacity could generate 500 megawatts. That's enough energy for 500,000 homes. But the downsides remain. The plant's uranium fuel would initially need to come from Russia. Currently, the US doesn't enrich fuel to levels required by this power plant. The other consequence is that of nuclear waste. In fact, nuclear power does generate highly uh, radioactive materials, which are uh, carcinogenic and it generates volumes of waste, which um, are, will persist in the environment for hundreds of thousands of years. Uh, and so it's, it's hard to brand nuclear power as clean uh, unless you're just talking about that one emission of, of carbon dioxide. So, um, so I think that's a misleading uh, label uh, for nuclear power. The approach isn't new. Russia already has a commercial sodium-cooled reactor since 2016. And such designs have also been tested in the US, simply because it's cost-effective and one of the fastest. Natrium technology is perhaps the way forward for advanced clean energy that can change the world. Bureau Report, We On, World is One. We On is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.